Hello everybody, welcome back to today's video. Today we're going to be installing the Sherrett Custom Parts, um, I don't know what you call this, the exhaust, shadow, exhaust, outline, trim, vinyl, piece, I don't know what you want to call it, I'll show you where it goes in a second. But basically, the little lip above the top of the exhaust on the John Cooper Works, uh, the Cupress and the Cupress with the John Cooper Works rear bumper, that sits on it and it makes a little outline, a little black shadow of sorts. You can have it in any colour you want, basically. I'll drop a link in the description where you guys can pick this up. But we're going to get it put on. I'm going to give the car a quick wipe down. I've got some alcohol wipes. I'm going to set the camera up and we're going to get it put on. Yeah, it might be a bit of a challenge trying to line that up, but we'll get there. I'm going to give it a bit of a wipe. Very good. I need to clean the exhaust pipes as well. So that goes like that. Okay. Just gonna make sure that's all pressed nicely. Peel that off. Right. <clears throat> Hopefully I can get this right. So I'm just gonna Temporarily place it. I'm happy with that. I'm going to work it round the edge, like so. Pull the cover off. I'm going to push that. Out. There we go. There we go. So on the grey, it's not very prominent, but you can definitely see it's there. I really like that. Probably could have done a bit better with pushing it up a tad bit more, but I'm not overly concerned about that. I think that looks fab. Really good. There we go. I like that, very subtle. Right then guys, thank you for watching today's video. Yet yeah, again, a very simple modification to do. I wouldn't even call it modification, it's more of a an aesthetic piece really, that's what it is. I'll put a link in the description where you guys can pick this up. Um, <clears throat> get out of the way of the light. I'll put a link in the description where you guys can pick this up. Um, I think it was, I can't remember the price of it now. About 10 pounds, something like that off the top of my head, I can't remember. Um, yeah. Really good, just sort of that aesthetic piece, which adds a little shadow, which is really nice. I've got two videos coming up that I really can't wait to show you guys. Um, I finally ordered the grill surround piece from Mini, so we've got that coming. That's coming by APC overnight, so that should be here tomorrow on Saturday, actually. So, <clears throat> all being well, when I finish work, if I finish in time, I can put that on and I'll do a video showing you guys. I might have to leave that till Sunday. But on the 9th of June, uh, we're taking the Mini to get a... Um, middle box resonator delete done which is gonna be fantastic there's so many videos of um you know uh so like a straight pipe decat uh, back box delete but there's not very many of a resonator delete that i can find to my specification of car um some you know <clears throat> i'm a bit nervous about getting it done and about the results i do hope the results are pleasing but apparently the it's the best exhaust modification the bang to your book or bang for the book exhaust modification that you can get by taking out that resonator or the middle box 
So we got that booked in on the 9th of June, and I'm going to take you guys along with me. We're going to get it done. I'm going to do before and after shots as well, which should be really good. So you're going to want to stay tuned for that. Stay tuned, hit subscribe, hit the notification bell. You'll be notified whenever I upload a new video. Anyway, thank you for watching, and I shall see you all in the next video.